So today we will see how to install Kali Linux on parallel desktop. Uh, first, go to Kali uh, website here on the download. Just uh, select what version you want, 64-bit or 32-bit. I already download uh, the 64-bit. Uh, the next step, we have to open parallel and click on the plus button. And then click install Windows or other OS from a DVD or image file. Click continue. Now we have to drag and drop the image that we download from Kali website. Just drop it. As we can see, sometimes we have we get this error in parallel desktop. I already have a video on my channel how to fix it, and we will see how to fix it even right now. All we have to do is click continue, uh, then more Kali uh, Kali Linux. Then hit OK. Here, yeah, customize setting before installation. Then create. Then go to hardware, boot order, advanced settings. Uh, since it's 64-bit, uh, we're gonna choose 64-bit. Uh, and here we add vm. Dot bios. Dot efi equals one. Then close this, then click continue. Now we are already in system problem. As you can see, graphic install. Okay, hit enter in the keyboard. <coughs> well, English, English, uh, just choose your country. American, English, okay. Now we detect a mod installation. Now detecting the network. It could it could take a little bit of time, maybe fifteen minutes. Here, choose Kali, continue. Local domain. <clears throat> continue here you have to choose your uh, user account just type Kali continue Kali continue and of course you have to choose a password then click continue just remember the password and of course your uh, account name or account user so you could log to your environment configuring the clock now just click continue is mm. here guide use the entire disk continue continue again of course all file in one partition just click continue Finish partition with in disk, continue. And here you have to click yes, and then continue. Now it's installing the base uh, system. Install the base system. Mm -hmm. Unpacking Linux image. Uh, as we know, the Kali Linux they already removed the root account, uh, so. You, but you still can create a root account. Uh, I'll make a video on how to, to create a, a root account because uh, Kali Linux removed a root account, I guess, from 2020, I think. But you can still create one. I will make a video how to do that so you can install software. 
now you have to choose your environment okay here I will just leave all as default and click continue this process could take a little bit of time maybe I will speed up the video for you guys so you don't have to wait now the installation it's already complete it took it took me about uh, seven eight minutes after the installation complete uh, click continue now click enter on your keyboard so we could log to the Kali Linux environment <coughs> So the user account was Kali and then the password, the password we just create. Now we have log to Kali environment. As I said, the Kali Linux, they already removed the root account. So if you op open up uh, your terminal, you are no longer root account. I will make a video on how to create a road account hope this video video was useful for you guys and see you on the next one